HPR cutting half inch mild steel, choosing the right process. Hello, this is Bob Chorney, one of the service engineers here at Hypertherm. Have you ever wondered what amperage to choose when cutting half inch mild steel? If you have an HPR 400, there are five different amperage choices for half inch, ranging from 80 up to 400 amps. How do you know what amperage to choose? Higher amperage will cut faster and lower amperage will cut more slowly. Can you just pick the highest amperage and speed? Typically, cutting at the highest possible amperage and speed will not produce the best edge quality or the best cut details, but those results might be fine for some parts. The yellow outline shows a spot where even a 260 amp arc has washed out the corner. Okay then, do you choose the lowest amperage instead? We usually don't recommend using the lowest possible amperage either. Slower cutting speed will take longer and can leave a lot of low speed dross on the underside, which means more scraping or grinding. Piercing with low amperage consumables takes longer also, and the consumables are more prone to damage. So generally what we recommend is using a medium amperage process. Medium amperage provides consistent edge quality, less distortion and better details than the highest amperage, yet at better speed than the lowest amperage. We refer to this as the sweet spot, a thickness near the middle of the cut charts. For 130 amps, the sweet spot is half inch mild steel. Selecting an amperage where your material thickness is near the middle of the cut chart delivers a good combination of quality, accuracy, and speed, along with good consumable life. This slide shows the improvement on the inside corner compared with the 260 amp and much less dross than the sample cut with 80 amps. In the end, the best amperage is a decision you and your customer should also discuss. It may be worth running some test cuts at different amperages. For critical parts with high accuracy requirements, if cutting at the next lower amperage improves details on a critical feature, it may be worth the increase in cutting time. Encourage communication between the plasma programmer and the plasma operator regarding specific part requirements. We have a course online at HCI, the Hypertherm Cutting Institute, called The Sweet Spot, if you'd like additional background. Thank you for watching. Please check back for more tech tips from Hypertherm.